Stand up if you did. Hey, there we go. One. Again, we thank you very, very much. And I can't begin to thank these people. I've said this so many times. My wife said you shouldn't say it again. But for an old music horse to ever get to direct the band, it's just like being here in the fire whistle and you can chase the fire. It's one of the greatest feelings that you can ever have. And these people have given me a lot of pleasure. Okay. And now we're going to have a problem because the senator is coming up. <laughs> and on behalf of the Table Rock Historical Society and its members, I want to tell you how much we appreciate you bringing all these wonderful musicians here to perform for us. The man just told me anybody that couldn't, didn't think they got $2 worth ought to put $5 in the kitty. So I think that uh, we all may be a, a debt to Eddie. I went to school with Eddie, and he's just as crazy then as he is now, and he lied all the time. That's why I got to school. <laughs> But I want you to know that he's a nice guy and you ought to stop and tell him how much you appreciate him being here tonight and putting on this concert for you. It isn't often you get a chance to have somebody with his Keller. extensive knowledge of music <laughs> and world renown throughout the whole United States. And for his, uh, I don't know what else to say about you. I mean, if I had Ernie here, he could go on for the next hour. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted you to know, Eddie, that you said it would rain. It's been pouring down out there, but now it's going to quit just in time for you to dismiss this group. And again, we thank you a lot for coming, we, Eddie. We appreciate it. Thank you. Very much. this 140 acres, what they were talking about. Eddie didn't need 140 acres. My grandfather always said, if you could dance, it was worth 140 acres. You didn't need it. We oh. used to love the dance with Eddie. <laughs> 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 the and we, now to close, ladies and gentlemen, I know that we all say that due to our grandparents, and in some cases our great-great-grandparents, they came to this great country to give us the opportunity to live and whether you were down to give you a chance to pull yourself back up, that we truly do live in one of the greatest countries in the whole world. God has really blessed us with all the blessings that he's bestowed upon us. And like we say so many times, he always seems to hold us in the palm of his hand. And so to close and to honor our great country and our great ancestors, we would like to close with God bless America. And if you feel like singing part of it, please join in. <laughs> Thank you, everybody.